This video is sponsored by Squarespace, the easiest way to create a beautiful website, all on your own terms. Hello, Chateau lovelies. In this episode, you get to vote. Guess what time it is? It is Bargain Hunt, not Bargain Hunt UK, but Bargain Hunt Paris. We are at a Paris flea market and we have given each other a challenge of 20 euros each. Who's gonna buy the best thing for 20 euros or under? And you guys get to vote. here with my sister Ashley, who also sings La Vie en Rose, theme song of Chateau Love, the gorgeous Tanya, who's also a fashion designer. We have here Christy, and she's also extremely talented. She makes beautiful jewelry. What else are you looking for today? Uh, antique jewelry. Okay, so we now have two of us, at least, looking for antique jewelry. Who wants to start shopping? I'm ready. Right now. Do we it. also have go. about one hour until they close. Yeah, let's, <laughs> so, go. Let's, let's go, go. let's go. We're let's go. in a hurry. <laughs> Are we gonna stick together? Are we no. gonna branch out? I'm feeling very competitive. <laughs> what else uh -oh. is <laughs> With my sister. <laughs> okay, girls, let's do it. Who's okay. gonna be the winner today? It could be art, it could be books, it could be jewelry, it could be antiques. Now, I know you guys don't have a lot of space in your luggage, no, but- No, looking for something very small. But a lot of the things in this market are actually really small. There's some really pretty artwork. This is not my usual style, but I do really like it. Isn't this interesting artwork, Ashley? It's going to be saint. Well, I think it's on how a woman is supposed to behave and looks as though. It's in English. It's all in English. It's right next to the catechism. <laughs> There's written markets of how to wash and iron. Oh. How to use good grammar. How to take care of your home. I, oh, there are little notes inside. Somebody's written. Yeah, some, someone took little notes. Look There's a this. whole thing about prepositions. I'm kind of in love with someone's this. Someone's whole life. Isn't wow. Sweet? I mean, look at this. Maybe this was all a girl needed to know back then. It's so sweet, isn't it? It's lovely. And here, this one is for my husband, St. Simon. His memories. <laughs> <laughs> he's watching this right now being glad he's not here I'm tempted by these because I think I, I would actually use them on a regular basis silver teaspoons oh, yeah. look at the design they're very pretty I so just have to see how much they cost I think you do need to see how much they cost will you help me monsieur oh, oh excuse moi excuse moi don't don't you c'est juste pour savoir le prix s'il vous plaît de, les petits 20 euros 20 euros c'est un bon prix 20 mm -hmm. he wants 20 but then that's all you can buy. But you could maybe negotiate. But they're small. Do you think that he would take 15? Well, I know I would use them. That would leave you with five. It doesn't hurt to ask. I, I do quite like them. And I know that I'll use them when you come visit. I'll use them with my friends. D'accord. Yeah. Ah, 1959. Okay, so that's how old they are. Um, I, know, I know I'm stopping quickly, but what are they made of? Are they... Are they... It's, it's some pot. They're not Stain. sterling, I don't think. I think there might be stainless steel, but they're heavy. They're, they're nice. They're, um, I think they look, I think they look pretty. They've got like a little hallmark on the back. Who made them? Can you see that? Kleeblatt. This is the rose pattern, but it is a very Art Nouveau sort of pattern, almost Art Deco. Rose. And I do love roses. I My favorite perfume is... My favorite song is La Vie en Rose, Ashley. <laughs> I actually wear um, a I think you should sing that song for me right now. Hold me close and hold me fast. That's enough. The magic spell you cast. You could buy spoons with roses. I could indeed. <laughs> I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Um, I think you should make him an offer. Okay. Monsieur, acceptez vous 15 euros? He's sticking to his guns. It's 20, 20 euros, Ashley. Are you going to do it? 18? Okay. Dix huit? Okay. 18? Okay. Merci. C'est très gentil, monsieur. You've got two euros left to spend on the 
bargain hunt challenge. Okay. I'm so happy. I haven't spent anything yet. That's, we just got that's here. Shocking. You made a rookie mistake. You know what you did? No, I didn't. You just you just bought stuff at the first dollar you stopped at. <laughs> No, it's not, though. You might win, though. See, you might win. See, Your instincts I, might be good. I love the it. The rest of us might hold out and end up with nothing. Oh. I'm actually really happy you bought that. I am These too. are your Love Beyond Rose little spoons and 20 I euros. Well done. That's a I good buy. Can you please put these, hold these Wait. for me, please? You can, you can hold the bag for your stuff. Oh, what a lovely bag you have. <laughs> such a good, I do love this bag. Okay. Shameless self-promotion. La Vie Parisienne, which has some slightly naughty images. And when in Paris. All right, let's go. You still have two euros to spend. Let's see what you can very, do. Very small. Okay, I'm aiding my competitor because she needs help translating. <laughs> she might have found her winning object, but she doesn't know how much it costs. It, it's gonna be way too expensive. Way, way it too expensive. It might not be. It might not be. We might get lucky. We do you have might a get limit. lucky. We do have a limit. But I might just have to get it anyway. Absolutely. Well, there's nothing to say you can't buy something outside the challenge. The challenge just has to be your 20 euros. Okay. Bonjour. And I think it's plated. It is. But so show us what you've got here. So it's, it's got a beaut. You're right. It's it's very Art Nouveau. It's got a beautiful. Um, what is that? An iris? Yeah. Oh, it's magnificent. You're lucky I didn't see that first. I'm a little jealous. <laughs> you've so got a just, very good eye. We just have to find. It would make a nice pillbox or something oh, as well, yeah. wouldn't it? It's just beautiful. I think. But the we need to find out how much it costs. It, it, you know, it's got the um, the front and back yes. print on it. It's beautiful. Just beautiful. Give me what I'd use it for. My emergency tea bag. Emergency tea bag. We found a new use because when you're stranded out somewhere around a bunch of coffee drinkers like us. A British person needs their tea bag. Exactly. <laughs> I wonder if it would be possible to add a chain, like have a jeweler. Ooh. Wouldn't that be beautiful? Because I think it's just small enough. It would make a very dramatic necklace. It really would. You're absolutely right. So it's hallmarked. Okay. Ah, oui, d'accord. Okay. Si vous voulez le lire. Ah, non, ça va, ça va. Je vous prête ma loupe pour regarder si vous voulez. Ah, oui, si oui. Voulez. Très bien. Okay, it's 35 euros. Would you like to offer him less? I doubt he'll take 20, but you could still keep looking for your other challenge items. It's, apparently it is sterling. The inside's been plated, and so it's hallmarked right there. I, I doubt he's gonna take 20 for it. No. I mean, you could still buy it and keep looking for something for the challenge. Okay. <laughs> Do you see anything? Oh, that is clip. quite lovely. Is it brooch? The clip. Oh! So it's like a... Very unusual. Might have gone on a shoe. It's the first time I've seen you. Thank you very much. Monsieur, you are very gentil and very charming. Accept your 30 euros. Yes. At this moment, yes. Yes! 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 It's a pretty clock. Oh, it's lovely. It was completely broken. Ah, uh, okay. So that clock is slightly broken, but it looks like it's reparable. This guy just got it for 25 euros. I know. Crazy. <laughs> See if this works. Hello. They're lapis lazuli, and I'm very tempted to buy those because those are magnificent. It's going way over my budget. Yes. I was hoping they would be fully costumed. They're not. They're the real thing. Well, I'll think about it. Yeah. I'm going to consider that. 
We're having so much fun out today shopping in Paris and I am so lucky to have such amazing friends, such a creative sister. And if you'd like to hear more of Ashley's music, go to ashleylockheed.com. As a professional costume designer, Tanya has been creating the most amazing things for productions around the world. And though she's a professional dancer, Christy also makes the most gorgeous jewelry out of recycled vintage beads. We've been talking a lot about ways that they can share their creativity with their own websites like Ashley has done with hers and like I have done with the Chateau Love online shop. Do you have ideas or products that you'd like to share? Why not easily create your own website using Squarespace? It's the simplest way to create a beautiful website and even sell products or content all on your own terms. You'll have control over the look and the feel of the website, updates, and managing your own online shop. There are incredible, easy to use templates, fabulous AI and SEO optimization capabilities, and the Fluid Engine, which enables you to design every aspect of your website yourself with drag and drop technology. Check out squarespace.com for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, use the link below to save 10% off your first purchase of a domain or a website. Now I've got to get back shopping or I am going to lose this competition. I have not found anything yet. Got these buttons. a bit of a weakness for findings and trims and Ooh, what is this? okay can't be making decisions on anything this early oh it looks like christy might have found some uh, antique pieces fashion designer thing this is probably sterling silver you could polish it and make a handbag out of it I don't think it's sterling, but it's, it's, it's old and it's pretty. It is old and pretty. If it's not sterling What's and not really hallmarked, it'll be cheap. The, yes, it's got the chain. Yeah. Attached. And what you do want to look for is that these are still solid. Okay. Because they're very hard to join again yeah. if you don't um, completely know your um, base metals. Um, but these are very solidly joined. Um, I think it's really pretty. It clips still. Uh -huh. That's nice. How old do you think it is? Hard to say. It could have just been left in a basement for a really long time. The design. Or... It's a bit. It's a bit ornate for um. Victorian. I think it's Victorian. Victorian. I think it's too ornate for deco or nouveau or anything oh, yeah, after that. Absolutely. I think. I think we're probably looking at Victorian. I Which kind of love it. Le, le meilleur prix pour ça, monsieur. Dix, he'll do it for 10 euros. It's Napoleon Trois, so Victorian era, yeah, mid 1800s. That's what we said, yeah. I think I'm gonna Eight. have a thing. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have a. Think. Okay, monsieur, <laughs> je vais le prendre pour 8 euros. Yeah. Merci. I'm gonna get it. Was the petit truc pour Napoleon Trois? Ah, oui, c'est ça. D'accord. Thank you, Monsieur. It's very gentil. That's for you for the moment. Okay, I just swooped in and took it. I mean, I was going to be gracious, <laughs> but if nobody's going to take it, I can sew a handbag too. Oh, no. Interesting things. I'm really, really interested in this. This is an Art Deco brooch with um, this is this is a lava cameo. So usually there are faces neoclassical faces but this is with these beautiful flowers and um, that's kind of interesting depending on the price I love this what I love about this one is that it's a little bit smaller for you know for if you don't want to wear something super exactly so that's really great for men and for women yes exactly Ooh. it's not too ostentatious well, I did in fact buy both of these lovely brooches. The Art Deco Lava brooch is available this week and the Dragon one will be listed next week. We also have this splendid Murano glass beaded floral necklace from the 1950s, an exceptional late Victorian signed hand-painted brooch depicting Cupid and Psyche, and this very interesting hand-carved castle brooch in an ornate woven pewter setting also from the Victorian era. To find these and lots of other lovely pieces of chateau-inspired jewelry and gifts, check out our online shop.
Chi, what do you see? Oh, that's beautiful. Wow, she's magnificent. And it's signed, but I can't it's tell if it's actually... No, it's okay. absolutely signed and it's absolutely hand-painted. Is it? Uh-huh. How much does she want for it? I don't know. I haven't asked yet. Oh, look. What's that on the back? It's like... Oh, it actually... So it's guarantee... Oh, on... I think it's painted on ivory. Really? Sur Ivoire. Wow. That's interesting. It's really so I just found these little boxes and they're just absolutely lovely and they have the Moj signature on it. This one is just like a little fan. They're quite lovely. The birds. I'm going to have to think about it. So I found this little cigar case and I thought so much for my husband, but there's no way to get it home. Those little cordial glasses are so amazing. The carving is so lovely, but there's no way to get that back across the pond. That was a pretty Hermes scarf you just spotted over there. It's the real thing. It's beautiful, but it's the one. It's a one. It's Which yeah. Is kind of a lot. It is kind of a lot. I mean, it's a fraction of the original. Like it's a fraction of the new cost, and it is a. Is it? A, it is a pretty design. I mean, we love the. I mean, look at those colors and the birds. Me too. It's timeless. But you are traveling, and you need to think of your budget. And it definitely does not fall into our um, into our twenty euro <laughs> challenge. Okay, this we just spotted. At first we thought it was the top of a cane. It turns out it's a pipe for smoking. There probably would have been a little mouthpiece in there. And this opens, and that's where the... What could we put in there and smoke, Ashley? Tobacco. <laughs> Do we know anybody that uh, likes peacocks? I think we all like peacocks. <laughs> we all love peacocks. Do we know anybody who likes to um, smoke the wacky tobacco? Probably not that likes peacocks. <laughs> I don't think the queen shall meet. I think I think you might be surprised. I love it. Why it's 20 euros, surprised? but I don't think this is going to win me the prize. What do you think? We have a serious competition going, and it is 20 euros, but I just... I think that will catch... That will... That will gather dust on the shelf. It might, unless I pick up a, a bad habit. <laughs> In my mid fifties, <laughs> like these. These are all needle pointed. It looks like they would have been for cushions or chairs. Um, I love them, but they might be out of my budget. But I do think they're really pretty. Okay, Ashley, I've just found the most incredible thing outside of our challenge. But there are two matching hand painted gold and white uh, planters. Seventeen hundred. So this is. une recherche sur internet. Vous allez voir que Gilbert, il vous a pas volé. Voilà. So he's explaining that this is the mark of Sèvres. And you see there's this beautiful royal monogram. Alors là, la couronne, vous savez ce que ça veut dire Yes. C'est notre président, le roi Macron. On l'appelle <laughs> le roi. Le roi Macron. <laughs> oh, how funny. Il nous a mis dans une situation dramatique. <laughs> he's, he's saying that Macron has crowned himself king. <laughs> mais mais c'est plutôt Louis, je crois. <laughs> oh, je crois. Mais je prends pour le roi. Hein. Lu, Lu, Louis Macron. <laughs> Louis Macron, voilà. Louis Macron. <laughs> hey, ça y est, on a trouvé le nouveau, le nouveau roi, c'est Louis Macron. <laughs> ouais. I've renamed the president Louis Macron. Les deux dames veulent venir au mariage avec nous. No, I'm working on it. Il va se marier en Tunisie. I'm hoping I can get a deal. What are your thoughts? Such a beautiful. And if you think that you're going to be thinking about them later, I think I'll be kicking myself in my lifetime if I buy them. <laughs> they, they are very beautiful. And, they'll, and I think it's going to be awkward to get them home. Je suis pas d'amis, j'ai que des amis. Nous sommes des amis. Il est très charmant, monsieur. Il est charmant. Merci beaucoup. Il est charmant. Il est charmant. Lui, il est vraiment charmant. Regardez, ils sont jaloux tous les deux. Regardez, il, va, il va se marier et on est invité. Et on va aller sur les îles. Hein? Il y a un lieu qui est Il m'a donné un deal. Parce oh, qu'il est charmant. Okay. Il est charmant, oui. Allez. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
was hard work. <laughs> so apparently Ashley behind us is my is my future husband. This guy was saying he's my husband. See, this is what happens because my hands were swollen this morning. I haven't worn my wedding ring. And apparently I have husbands at every corner at the market. <laughs> and it's Limoges. Uh -huh. And it's from the 1960s. And I was thinking... This is my husband yes. playing this guitar and singing to me. I love it. I love the colors too. I think the colors are really interesting. They're lovely. I like the, it's kind of a, a little bit like a toile de jouy, a little bit, you know, it's, it's, it's a couple of colors, but it's not like all the colors. I just think it's so cool. It'd look great, it's like on a black jacket black or something. Jackets. Wouldn't that be amazing? We we'll like it for you, huh? you can clean it. Oui. Oh, it's stunning. Very it's French. Annie and me. <laughs> My husband is a guitar player and singer. Oh, yes. So nice. I was like, it's perfect. Yes, perfect. Did you want to make what an offer? Nice yes. It, uh, what do you think I should offer? Well, have you gotten your 20 euro object yet? Yes. Well, you could ask her if she'll take 20 for okay, it. Okay, well, done. Oh, well done. <laughs> Okay, I'm getting a little panicky because I bought my Sevres planters, but I still have only spent eight euros for our challenge. And that's if that's even gonna be what I counted for my challenge. I kept thinking I was gonna find something so much better. Everybody else has got their thing and I still don't have it. I'm gonna lose. This is terrible. So now I have to hurry. As we're packing up, let's see if I can find something, something here that's going to be spectacular. 20 euros or under. Fingers. I hope that this place stays up long enough for Tanya to come down. She loves to collect vintage buttons and look at all of these. It's just amazing. Monsieur, ça fait combien le petit, le petit pot là? Non, ça. Il a 40. 40. Ouais, mais il est un peu abîmé là. Ah oui, d'accord. Et le petit cache-pot, c'est ça 60. 60. Ok, merci beaucoup. Merci. Ok, I like those, but they're too much. Oh, look how sweet that is. What a beautiful box. Bonjour, monsieur. Bonjour, These are pretty. So I am officially out of time. Um, and I think I might have to uh, forfeit this one and take it as a loss. Um, just, th there are some beautiful things, but we have to bear in mind, we have to carry it. And everything I love is just way too much money. Um, so I might have to just stick with my Aunt Nouveau cigarette hole and um, hope the girls have had better luck. I think I finally found my piece for the challenge just as everybody's packing up. It's this very, very beautiful um, old embroidered Asian picture on silk and it's framed. But I think I could take it out of the frame, use the frame for something else and um, and yeah. So this is, the, she's asking 25. Hey, Madame, vous m'avez 20 euros. 20? Okay, 20 euros. This is mine for the day. And she's literally packing up on me. I love this though, this is great. Oui, j'ai mon 20 euros. <laughs> Merci à vous. C'est très sympa. C'est très, très joli. I love the colors. It's really pretty. So I'm quite literally waddling down this market holding two Sevres gold planters and this big framed picture. And now I've got to go find my sister and Tanya and Christy. And we're going to see what they came up with on the way. Well, something amazing just happened. Um, and I was walking past the stool that they were just packing up. And I discovered a piece of fabric that I absolutely adore. The colors are wonderful, but um, I didn't have a chance because she was packing up to film it. So um, the reveal for them is going to be the reveal for you as well. Oh, you found, 
Did you found one? It's too big. Antique knife, but they feel, they feel good when they're too big. I know, but that's like a sheet. It's essentially like okay. Like C'est trop grand. It's trop grand. Okay. <laughs> C'est gentil. There's another one down here. Let me show you. Come really? with me. You yes. Know, you know, I'm like, I know you're okay, you're on the quest. Too. I know, She's I got a nice it. one that doesn't have sleeves, which is better for Florida. I saw it. It felt like flax. <laughs> I felt like flax. Uh huh. <laughs> you making friends? I looked down here. I think I already saw the one that you're talking about. Obviously. Yes, but it's nice. She's asking thirty for it. It's nice. I thought about buying it for you as part of our challenge, but then she wouldn't. You know, <laughs> it was thirty, not twenty. I put my hands on it ten times already. I'm okay, I think I now. think it's perfect. Get it? You're re you'll regret it if you don't. Well, and she I'm might take twenty five. Talking about the one with the long sleeves. No, I'm talking about the one that's sleeveless because you live in Florida and you'll prefer the one that's sleeveless. It's really pretty. Oh. It's the second one in. I've, yeah, I've, I told Tony I was like, I'm this close to getting this one. That one? You, you want should... the one with the sleeves? Well, or, oh, you're talking about that this one? one? Yes. Yeah. That this, one is, is freaking, huge. it doesn't matter. I never have to worry about gaining weight. It doesn't, it, does look, it doesn't matter. It is, look, and actually, it's it not is, as huge as you think it is. Hold it. It is. Do the boob test. The bo okay. Okay. Yeah. Look at that. Look, look at that. Stop. It fits. <laughs> it actually fits. It fits. It fits. It's, it's huge, but I, it does. No, it's a little it thing. Really, really would You'd wear it all the time. And I would never grow out of it. And and, it, and if you decided. <laughs> you know, after having worn it several times that really it was just too big and uncomfortable, you'd have to give it to your sister <laughs> who care, who would not care at all. Oh, oh how beautiful. That would, be so that would fit That's Wren. Little, that would fit you, Christy. I just That's have to say person. something. Hi. Hi, Vivian. My name is Carol. Hi, Carol. I live in the States. I own a retail store. I watch you all the time. Oh, I love you. Here. I love you. I love you. I'm gonna cry. I know. I know. And they say, I think I'm gonna cry. I said, I you said that because I know you come here. That's my sister. Oh, yeah. I said, hi. 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 Get it. get it. Okay, I'm gonna get it. Get it. Actually, I mean, don't. Okay. This is not my challenge. Maybe get it. It should drop a price. Maybe. Maybe. It's you very own it. brand for Wait. me. My poor husband. It's sexy. It. It's sexy. <laughs> <laughs> sleeping in vintage Parisian linen. I mean, old, like 40s. Listen. It's. I don't. I know it's not sexy, but it's for me. The French. The, pr the French <laughs> have been have been procreating for hundreds of years in this nightwear. <laughs> <laughs> I think that, you know, th I think that, that leaving something desired is the sexiest thing of all. <laughs> so pretty, isn't that? This is beautiful. This would not, well, would that fit you? I don't know. It's so beautiful. This little, this you could try the boob test. Ashley just did. This little thingy right here would it's have so, to be just right. I actually, yeah. I actually think this is a tiny, tiny waist. I think, I that, think that that would fit Ren. And look, it's actually been monogrammed right there. Isn't that exquisite? Yeah, it looks like this is probably hand. And the yeah, whole this whole is thing is handmade. Look at this lace. I love that antique linens. Look at, look at what I've been jogging down the street in. This is not practical for sightseeing, is it? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'll show. That's my twenty. That's my twenty oh, euro challenge. Okay. I'm gonna show it to you guys in a minute. Yes. Okay, I'm ready for my twenty euro challenge. Are you guys ready? Have as as every because yes, nine. you've got. I yes, but sort no, of but yes. <laughs> well, we can. We'll walk back that way, and we we may still get lucky on the way. Um, and then I think we should have lunch. Yes. Okay. And show our treasures. Now, everybody, it is the moment of truth. It's time to vote. We're going to go in alphabetical order. Ashley, Christy, Tanya, and then me. We're each going to show you our 20 euro or less item. And you get to vote. So in the comments, I'm going to count every single vote and let you know next week who the winner was. What, so, what do we win? What do we win? <laughs> you, you, you win a trip to stay with me at the chateau. <laughs> we get tomorrow, you get, to, you get to stay with me. Get that anyway. All right, shall I? Actually, I'll say, I'll, you know what? I'll make it sweet. The winner gets a piece of jewelry. 
So one of you three girls gets a piece of jewelry. Contestant number one, Ashley Lockheed, singer extraordinaire of La Vion Rose. This is a 1959 set of six espresso spoons. Ooh. And they have little roses on them, and I thought they were incredibly lovely and practical. I know I will use them, and I will be able to share them with all of my friends. Signed on the back. There we go. And they're very sweet. They remind me of my grandmother, too. She always had beautiful teaspoons and rose lotion and perfume and things like that nice. that's lovely so oh, you goodness. went for a sentimental choice i did Meaningful, also practical useful practical french vintage and how much did you spend 18 euros Ooh! so you didn't even spend the full amount no she, mm. he was asking 20 and i i offered 15 so, so i wonder 18. if you get extra points for that okay And now we have the beautiful Christy. Christy. Yes. First of all, tell us, how much did you spend? I spent my full amount, the 20 euros. Okay, so fair enough. It's hard to spend less than 20 euros in this day and age with inflation and all. What did you get? Well, I said I liked the antique jewelry, so I found a little Limoges brooch. It looks like it's been printed with some hand-painted embellishments. Let's turn it over and see the back. Ooh, and it's got a lovely trombone clasp. It has indeed been stamped on the back. It's just gorgeous. The reason I liked it was because my husband is a singer and he plays guitar. So in my thoughts is that he's playing guitar and singing to me and that's me. I so. think that's wonderful. birthday girl who was very mysterious because while the rest of us were kind of keeping an eye on what we were buying you went in the opposite direction I did I did but I was it was more that I wanted to just cover ground rather than <laughs> I was being competitive but and I really did think I was like running out of time and I was never gonna find anything mm -hmm. and then at the last minute, Ooh, what'd you get, at what'd the you get? very last minute Oh, it's big. Ooh. What is this? <gasps> and it's so oh my beautifully gosh. woven. This is incredible. And it's massive. That is beautiful. Is it? Oh. Is it like a bed? And yeah. it's actually your birthday. And look at this incredible thing that you found. That's so lovely. That is so, so beautiful. It's, I love these colors. These are actually my colors. And it <laughs> I think was, it's so beautiful. It, it was definitely the colors on the stool that, yeah. um, you know, drew me to it. Um, and it just shone in that sunlight. That yes, was it was. Beautiful sunlight as we were walking around. Yeah. Just stunning. Well done, you. So what are you going to use it for? Um, well, I think it definitely has to go on my bed. Yes. And we need to make it back to, uh, it, we need to get it back to America. But you know the best thing about it? What? Guess how much it was. How much? 10 million. Oh, oh no. <laughs> yes. Okay, so you probably get, ex first of all, you get you get points for it being your birthday, your actual birthday today. Happy birthday, Tony. <laughs> also, um, I mean, you obviously get points for for what? how much you spent but so so do you get did you get something else so is there something else in I your did, 20 euros i did get so i actually spent 15 in all um and i really want to bring this um you, so you still kept it under 20 you spent 15 kept, euros still spent, wow but look how cute these are this oh, is they're hand embroidered. embroidered how beautiful Little, from the 1950s yeah or i think actually 40s maybe 30s or 40s oh we've got a date 1914. Oh, wow, that old 1914, how beautiful. And then we should have a date on this one. But this is the cellulose ones that you can't always get. They had two of these, this one's hand painted. Oh, it's beautiful. 
And we can probably look up the stamp and find out the date for this one as well. But... Well, actually, I wonder if it says on the, let's, it's five centimes to mail, but that doesn't mean it was mailed the year it was made. Mm. Let's turn it over. It's... How beautiful the writing is. Mm. How beautiful everyone's handwriting. Okay, so this is very impressive. Okay, so Tanya, who <laughs> is number three? You, if you want to vote for Tanya, she's number three. If you would like to vote for Ashley, she's number one. If you want to vote for Christy, she is number two. And then finally at number four, and I'm not expecting to win, but I will happily show you what I got. Okay. And at number four, Ooh. having spent my entire 20 euros, I realized that, um, Now that makes me a bit of a spendthrift compared to the rest of you guys. <laughs> I, I was extravagant. I was extravagant. But at the very last second, right as they were closing up, I got this beautiful oriental hand embroidered, um, well, it, I don't even know what to call it. It's embroidered silk. And probably this would have been used when Shinwasari was the fashion. I loved the, the colors. The colors are my colors. They're very pink, soft blues, golds. And my first thought was I would try to remove the embroidery and maybe put it on a helmet or a balance or um, something like that, maybe create a cushion, but, it, but it's beautifully framed. And now that I've got it in the light and away from all the other junk of the flea market, I think I actually just want to hang it on the wall like this. I think it's really pretty. Nice. Very pretty. You want to vote for number one. <laughs> the teaspoons. Number two, the beautiful Limoges brooch. Number three, the magnificent cards and an unbelievably fantastic bedspread. And don't forget that whoever you vote for, the winner will get a piece of Chateau Love jewelry. And so, I mean, how does one choose between these three amazing ladies? <laughs> Ashley's like, I got plenty of jewelry from my sister. <laughs> Number four gets to give herself a piece of jewelry. So I encourage anybody watching, please don't vote for me because obviously that would be sad for my friends. <laughs> okay. And on that note, now we're gonna party because it's Tanya's birthday. I'm in a world apart, a world where roses bloom. And when you speak, angels sing from above. And life will